agree. Don't agree with what now? Um, that apple pie is better than any other pie. I don't agree with that. But it's the best pie there is. How could you disagree with that? <sighs> I, I don't get it, Savannah. I don't get it. Pumpkin pie is easier to make. That's a, that's a good point. You mm -hmm. just Pumpkin pie is easier to make. But the best things are the hardest things. Rome wasn't but, built in a day. Okay. Because pumpkin pie is better than apple pie. No, 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 no. Yeah. No, it's not. Yes, it is. What makes it, it better? So if you're I going for a nutritional dessert on Thanksgiving, you're saying it should be apple fritter? Oh, yeah. I think I, I think I can agree with that. But I don't think overall apple fritter is the best. But if you're going for nutrition, I agree with that. There's so many other fruits that go in pie that are better. Like there's chocolate. There's also That's chocolate. Oh, whoa, 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 that go on pie that are better. Chocolate. And I think but you also, want your pie to hit you hard. Boom, apple cinnamon. But if you're Boom, having a nice relax cinnamon. but if you're having a nice relaxing day, you're gonna want a nice relaxing pie. You disassemble the cake and you just had the frosting and the cake. Both of those would be good on your own frosting. Yeah, frosting's too sweet. Yeah. Too sweet. Fro pie, Apple cobbler? That's like a oh, fan favorite. Good point, good point. I think uh, actually apple fritter is the best dessert. Apple fritter is the best dessert. So better than apple pie. Yeah. So we're out of the pie category. Now. Yeah. So this opens it up to anything on the dessert table. Yeah. So what about chocolate chip cookies? Pie. Whipped cream, vanilla ice cream. No, no, n n no. <laughs> it's better than vanilla ice cream. Yes. It's got it's got a little bit of sweetness. It's got a yep. little bit of that good dietary fiber in the apples. And you're getting you're getting all these, these key it's nutrients. They are Have you ever had a not mushy pie? Yes. If they're not mushy, yes. put in pie. If they're not mush, they're too solid. Because you because can't why? put whipped cream on apple pie. Yes, it doesn't you can. make sense. Ready for this? Ready for this? Yeah, you I'm ready. Your pumpkin pie. Pumpkin okay, pie. I have you it. put a scoop. You take a scoop of vanilla ice cream. No, no, Ready? that combo you doesn't work. You haven't changed my mind, but you've made me reconsider where I'm that, sitting. That's good to hear. You, you've taken the first step in making me think, maybe pumpkin pie is better. Oh, I think there's like a thing on the, on the front that's like, the change shot. my mind, apple Change pie. Sam's mind, I'm yeah. Sam. You want change my mind. Pie. My opinion is apple pie, it's the best pie there is. All of Thanksgiving, okay. man. Yeah. Strawberry rhubarb pie. I rest my case. No. So for the people that weren't, no, 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 no. For, the, for people that don't know, rhubarb is sweet celery. <laughs> Rank stuff. Very, very disgusting. Not worth it. Don't go and try it. Thank you. So today, special segment of Change Sam's Mind. We're doing a Thanksgiving food draft with none other than... Gavin Rigby. Gavin Rigby. So we're gonna be taking turns drafting Thanksgiving foods. Gavin as the guest will have the first pick. We're doing non-dessert items only, and so on. My first overall selection will be stuffing. Stuffing, I first think stuffing overall. is my first overall pick. It's tasty, it's bread seasoning and sausage. Give me mashed potatoes, first pick. It's a respectful pick. Thank you, I, thank I you. I respect that opinion. All right, my second pick, steak. It's called Turkey Day for a reason. It's it called Turkey Day for a reason. It has to be turkey. Yep, that's it where I was gonna go with it. You should consider this one, it's the ham. You gotta wow. consider the ham. Number two. At number, at number two. I'm trying. Third overall pick. Under the sleeper. It's always the yolks. Forget about it. It's always there though. I'm going for rolls. That's, that's a, nice, a good pick. Nice right on your Thanksgiving table. I typically, yeah. I typically do too, and I'm gonna have to take take the cornbread. Take the cornbread. Third overall. Third overall, the cornbread. Yeah. Okay. I, so to recap, so far, first three picks. First three picks. I have. Stuffing, turkey, and rolls. Sam Very has. solid Thanksgiving squad. I have mashed potatoes, the best food on the table. Then I have ham to back that up. You gotta have, you gotta have some meat with your food. And then I have cornbread, which right. competes with rolls, I, I think. Yeah. You, you, you're saying mashed potatoes are not the best food on the table? No, no, no mashed potatoes are good. Let, let me say this. Okay. Mashed potatoes are good. Great, the top, best on the table. Top three. Top three. Top three. So what about like sweet potatoes? Is that not a thing that you guys do? Sweet potatoes? Crowd? No, sweet potatoes. no, no. Sweet potatoes are on my table. Sweet potatoes are there the day after, and a day after that, okay. and the day oh. after that. And you know what else is better? Stuffing. Get Stuffing out. is better Get than out. mashed potatoes. Get out. I'm gonna put number one, number stuffing. Uh, are you sure? So uh, that's for that reason, I'm gonna have to say mashed potatoes are gonna be better than anything you can do with a sweet potato. That's fair. So why don't you think mac and cheese should be on the Thanksgiving table? 
What's wrong with it? Too much cheese, first of all. Well, that's like a main mac component of mac and <laughs> cheese. You know mac and cheese? Mac and cheese, I do. I'm very familiar with it. It's quite, quite wonderful. Quite wonderful. Listen to that, remember that. It should be on the Thanksgiving table. Disagree. But we do need to remember it's Thanksgiving, okay. and we're not here on Thanksgiving to get our protein, get our, all our nutrients for weightlifting, okay. and getting strong. We're here to celebrate Thanksgiving with our family. Do you like it when foods on the plate touch? Depending on the food. Think about it, when yep. gravy is on the turkey and slides down the turkey onto the plate and it pulls, and it starts touching everything. That's do fine. you want the, do you want that that gravy I'm like, on your mac and cheese? Why not? We want the best foods there is. And frankly, I think mac and cheese is one of the best foods you can put on a table any time of the year. That's why I think it should, it should be at Thanksgiving. I, well, I don't know if I call it food, though. Mac You're saying cheese, mac and cheese yeah. isn't a food? Like, do we need more carbs on the Thanksgiving? It's Thanksgiving, why not? You want, you want as much carbs, protein, sugars, whatever you want. Have as much of whatever you want. It's Thanksgiving. Okay. Go crazy. One second, just putting some things away.